connecting to Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi connected. Hi guys, my name is Esli and welcome back to my channel. But if you're new here, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and ring the notification bell. Mostly my contents are unboxing and tutorials, but I also do review some supplements for kids and for adults. By the way, I am a small business owner here in the Philippines. If you're interested in authentic supplements, kindly check my Shopee store and I will put the link on the description box. In this video, I'll be showing how we'll use the Topo app to reconnect your Topo device to a new Wi-Fi network. Let's first make sure that we are connected to the internet. In case these steps did not work for you, you should probably do a physical reset on your camera. To do a physical reset, you just have to slide the camera lens upward, then press and hold the reset button for at least 5 seconds or until the LED indicator shows a blinking red light and your camera will reset at this point. So let's start by downloading and installing the Topo app from Google Play Store. Let's open the Topo Android app. If you need to register first, please watch my topo video. You can find the links in the description. After the registration, go to the login screen and type your username and password. You will now see the two-factor authentication screen. This is optional, but if you want to activate this feature, just type the six-character pin that has been sent to your email. This additional security layer is great for customers, which further protects Topo devices from possible hacks and tampering. It's just better security overall. So that's two-factor authentication for you using the Topo app. I'm going to skip this two-factor authentication for now, and I'll go straight to the My Home screen here. In the My Home screen, select and open the camera you want to reconnect. You will then see your camera as it is streaming the live video feed. Now go to the camera settings screen by pressing the gear icon on the top right. While you're on the camera settings screen, click the remove camera button. By removing the camera, it will allow us to reconfigure and change the network settings. You'll know that the reset is successful once you hear the voice prompt. Reset successful. Rebooting camera. Please wait. Let's go back to my home screen. Press the cross icon on the top right. In the other device screen, make sure camera is selected so you can see the list of cameras on the right panel. Select the Top OC200 camera. You can find your camera model at the bottom of the physical camera itself. You will now see the power up and check the LED screen. Don't press the next button yet. Wait for another 20 to 30 seconds for the blinking red and green lights to appear before clicking the next button. After the red and green lights have started blinking, go back to your Topo app and you can now click the next button. If the alternating red and green lights does not appear, you may have to press and hold the reset button on your physical device for at least 5 seconds and wait for the red and green lights to start blinking. If your location is turned off, you will be asked to turn your location on, on your Topo app. After that, let's come to the connect to device screen. Press the connect button to connect your phone to the Topo device by using a temporary network. Finally, select and connect to your new Wi-Fi network. You will hear a voice prompt confirming that you have successfully connected your phone and your Topo C200 device to your new Wi-Fi network. Connecting to Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi connected. After successfully pairing your Topo camera with your new Wi-Fi network, you will now be able to stream live video feed to your phone. And if you like, you can also test if the connection is indeed working. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching and have a good one.